Don't let anybody tell you the Nokia Lumia 920 and HTC Windows Phone 8X are the only things worth getting excited about this week. What recently arrived at my doorstep was the exclusive T-Mobile USA variant of the Nokia Lumia 820 called the Lumia 810. We're going to give it a full review treatment in the days ahead, but for now, let's see what's inside the box, and let's see what the device feels like when we get our hands on it. I'm Michael Fisher. This is PocketNow.com. Let's check out the Nokia Lumia 810. Now, the first thing I noticed about the Lumia 810's packaging is that it is larger and more substantial than uh, other high-end Nokia Lumia phones like the 920 I very recently unboxed as well. Uh, as you can see, it's got the, the device here in a very glossy relief on the front of the box. There's the T-Mobile branding on the side. They're kind of blurry. It's so fast, it's blurry. And uh, features on the back here, just a few of them. Uh, eight megapixel cameras called out, front-facing cameras called out, uh, 1080p video recording, dual-core 1.5 gigahertz processor. That is the uh, Qualcomm Snapdragon S4 Plus. Uh, up to 32 gigs of expandable memory through micro SD as well. So this box opens in a very interesting manner. Uh, this was an important notice, and it has been the seal has been broken. So Windows Phone branding on the bottom. We just pull that slides out right on the bottom, and that's pretty cool. I think I haven't seen that kind of packaging all that often. Here is the device itself, which we will come back to in just a second. Go ahead and take this off of here. Interesting packaging. This is, manuals have been included in a little envelope that comes in with this module here. User guide is in there, as well as uh, initial setup, probably some warranty information as well. That's all held together very nicely. Alas, no more accessories uh, than we had on the Lumia 920 over at AT&T. Just a wall charger and a USB cable. No headphones, no fun stuff, not even an NFC tag it looks like. No, nothing. Sad face. But let's get back to the device. Uh, continuing this trend here of uh, really helpful labeling of features on the screen protector here, the back home and quick search buttons are all called out, as is the charger on the bottom. Camera key on the side, standard for Windows Phone. Interesting responsiveness there. You can hear it. Very sharp click on the uh, half press to focus, a very dull click on the full push, and a lot of travel on that key there as well. Uh, volume down, volume up, power. These definitely don't feel as premium as on the 920. Very, very obviously plastic, or if they're metal, they feel plastic. Uh, headset port volume, yada, 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 yada. Looks like a noise canceling microphone up top there. Headphone jack on top as well. Here's your speaker view on the bottom. And on the other side of the phone, not much going on, but we have some call-outs here. We have a cover releases down here, they tell us. That's very nice. We'll get into that in the full review. And the protector on the Carl Zeiss lens for the camera there, which is an 8-megapixel shooter. Let's come back around to the front, see if we can take off the screen protector here. Great, great sound. That right there is the sound of progress. Gonna go ahead and press the power button here. One, two, three. Had a little vibration buzz there. There's our T-Mobile branding. Theoretically, this should be uh, final software. We'll get into details on the review. While the phone boots, we just take a little tour around, slowly. There's our Nokia brand. Buttons are that off-white color that we see, that we've discussed. On the uh, same as on the Lumia 920, just a little off-white, a little on the green side. Whether you like or dislike that is going to depend on your own taste. There's our Windows Phone 8 splash screen and the start screen. As I mentioned at the top of the video, we're going to have a full review on this device in the next few days. Stay tuned for that. In the meantime, if you want to leave us a comment, let us know about something you want specifically covered, do that in the post at pocketnow.com. If you leave a comment here on YouTube, we generally don't check those because we are too busy reviewing phones and doing other kind of stuff. But do leave us a thumbs up if you like the video. Follow us on Twitter, Pocket Now Tweets. Follow me on Twitter. I'm pretty social there at Captain Two Phones. It's Captain, the number two phones. And stay tuned for a lot more coverage 
on the Nokia Lumia 810, as well as every other Windows Phone, Android, iOS device we can get our hands on at Pocket Now. Thanks for watching. We'll see you soon.